What's up guys, it's Terminal Gamer here, bringing you another step in the step-by-step -step guide of the raid. This time it is the Golgoroth Cellar, and I'm going to be showing you guys how to unlock the door to get to that chest in the gold cellar. Now, me and my friends have be a map in the top right-hand corner of the screen throughout this whole video, so you can basically see where I'm going. But what you want to do, as soon as you spawn in, you want to head left, and basically you just follow the path to the left until you get to where I am, and you will end up at a plate. Bentley found it right there, and if you jump up where I am, that is where a calcified fragment is for you guys, just to let you know. So now from this plate, if you want to head back to the start, so basically you go right from the plate all the way across to the other end until you reach a dead end. And then you will end up number two, which I believe it is. And I will give you some codes down below of the order of the plate activation sequence. So when you get to this plate, when you get to these plates, you just want to leave one person at every plate. As you can see, the plate I was shooting there was plate number two. So as I was saying, you want to leave one person at each plate. And then there's a certain sequence that you have to activate to get the door to open. Now you need only five people, no you only really need four people to do this, but by what my friends have told me, if you leave during this, then you won't be able to get the chest. If you get here, you need to do it to get the chest when you get there. If you leave, it's gone, you can't get it. So on this next part, this is plate number three. Now this one is a little more tricky, and to do it, you have to jump on this pillar right here, to the right where Atlas has just jumped up. Now, I believe Titans can jump straight up to that gap where I'm shooting right there. If you hold your ghost out, you'll see a little hole in the door, in the wall above the door, that Titans, as you can see, it just got pointed out by that grenade, that Titans, I think, are the only ones to get up there, but everyone else, I believe, have to jump to the left of that pillar, and there is a pillar hovering right there, which I start shooting to notify Alex, because it was his first time doing this, so I was just showing him how it was doing, how it was, been done but then spinning just goes and shows off and I've just realized you can do it with a hunter because spinning just goes and does this you'll see in a minute I think he has the bones of EAO so I believe that is the only way you can do it spinning's up there so you leave him at number three and then the rest of us all head off to plate number four now to do the sequence the best way that me and my team have done it what I find the easiest I've done it three or four times now is if you so the player starts and it jumps onto the plate. If his, con if his controller doesn't vibrate, step off the plate, try again. Just keep doing that over and over again until the first player's controller vibrates. Then the same with the second, third, and then fourth, and then you should hear the door open. Everyone should know because all you'll hear is a door opening sound, basically. It's very obvious. You can hear it from anywhere around the cellar. And yes, yeah, so the fourth plate, guys, you just want to head, basically, from the right of plate three, until you get to the middle part where there's a door behind you, which will be the chest door, head straight up there towards the exit, and then you want to look right, and you want to head all the way down that right-hand path until you get to the plate number four. Now, this is relatively simple, guys, once you get the hang of it. you just got to communicate. Now, as I said, there will be the codes in the link to, in the description down below. I don't think you can get an exotic from this. I'm pretty certain you can't. But yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, guys, please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll talk to you all next time. See ya!